know what? I want to talk about transfers. And you know, um, we've been talking about attacking players. Um, a lot of the forums that I'm in, um, us guys, we've been talking about attacking players and um, Coutinho, um, Fakir, all this other stuff. But, and we've been talking about the defence as well. And I want to throw this one out to you guys, yeah? Ironically, we're playing Palace, yeah? You'll see in, my other, in the other review that I just done, we're playing Palace. And I'm thinking, Moreno is shocking as left back, yeah? He, he's terrible. We know this. I, you, I, in my other videos, you'll, you'll hear me saying, I can't take Moreno. I don't rate him. He's a nice guy, but I just don't rate him. Right, so I'm thinking, in terms of cover... Because we know Robertson has nailed down the left back spot. And for any successful team, you kind of need, you need cover in all positions, as we know. But you almost need those players to be cool with like, they're not going to start every match. At the same time, you want the players to be hungry, full of desire, and they're ready. Every single time they come on, they're ready to go. And they're not going to really disable the team. So I'm thinking... Left back because we haven't really spoken about left back. If Robertson, everyone keeps talking about Van Dyke and we've got the problems at centre back, centre back, and we lacked a little bit of creativity in the midfield. But I, I, I'm people are missing out left back, left back position. Yeah, if we lose Robertson, we're in big trouble. Like big, big, big trouble. If Robertson goes, he offers so much on that side that it's. It's near impossible to replace him unless you're getting quality. And that's what I'm saying. If we get a quality player on the left, we can't really go to like Barcelona and those kind of teams with their big hitters. Because that means if we get a big hitter player on the left, him and Robertson, that's not going to work. Because they both want to be first teamers. But we kind of need someone who is somewhere half decent, but at the same time, wouldn't ain't, ain't going to fuss too much if they're not starting every game. So maybe like Klopp could rotate them every couple of games, puts them in, like what he's doing with Trent on the other side. Um, so my pitch is for Van Patrick Van Arnholt. Yeah. Now, I've looked at his stats. I think he scored five goals last season. Um, I think he's got two assists or one assist last season. And I think he's got two goals this season. I don't think he's got any... I think he might have one assist this season. I, I, um, I'll have to double-check the stats. But I watched this guy in terms of his contribution to the game. He's playing for Palace right now. Now, let's be, let's get real. Um, Palace are not winning anything, like, anytime soon under Roy Hodgson. They will not win a trophy. I don't even think they're going to push for, like, top um, the top six or anything like that. They literally always fight in relegation. But it doesn't mean they haven't got good players. For example, they've got Zaha, good player. Townsend, you know what I mean? Um, but Van Arnholt, I've watched this guy for the last couple of seasons, from when he was at Sunderland. And to me, he offers a lot on the left-hand side. He's very attacking. I think he fits into the Liverpool mould very, very well. And I think he's a player that will thrive under Klopp. A bit like how Robertson did. No one saw Robertson last year. Sorry, the season before, when he was at Hull. We took him and look now. He's a he's a he's a household name. I think we can do the same with Van Ar Van Arnholt, and I think he would fit into the Liverpool way very 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 quickly. Um, so yeah, I I think if if Klopp's gonna sign a player, whether it's whether he does it in the summer, I'm saying like for the January window, he could do a little sneaky coup and go in for Van Arnholt. I think that's a decent shout at left back. Yeah, for um, this transfer window, I don't even think he'll cost that much. Yeah, Palace are in. The Palace are not gonna. They're not doing nothing. Yeah, so I think him going to us would benefit. Um, let me know your opinion, guys. Yeah, let me know your opinion. Yeah, because I know I put these wild things out there sometimes. I get a lot of backlash, but I I, I can see Van Arnholt there. You know what I mean? It's like yeah, last season there's a couple men that I said to them, Richarlison. I said he's decent, and look, Everton went and took him. And yeah, he's still not the finished article, but you can see a player there. He's playing for Brazil now. I said that from long time ago, long time ago, the first half of the last season, I said, Richarlison, watch out for that guy. A lot of man peppered me on the forums and look. So Van Arnholt, remember I said that, Patrick Van Arnholt, left back, Liverpool, I think that will work. Trust me.